Despite four years of active hostility toward climate science coming from the very top of our federal government, the American people managed to still meet our original commitment under the Paris Agreement. As the world's second largest emitter of greenhouse gases, the U.S. has to lead. We have enormous responsibilities. But you know the facts. We also need China and India leading on this issue. We need Russia leading on this issue, just as we need Indonesia and South Africa and Brazil leading on this issue. We can't afford anybody on the sidelines. I have to confess, it was particularly discouraging to see the leaders of two of the world's largest emitters, China and Russia, decline to even attend the proceedings. And their national plans so far reflect what appears to be a dangerous lack of urgency, a willingness to maintain the status quo uh, on the part of those governments. And that's a shame. I understand that it's harder to get international cooperation. There are more global tensions. But there is one thing that should transcend our day-to-day -day politics and normal geopolitics, and that is climate change.